There was several different kinds of rules. Um, one was no hanky panky, no sex while you were doing the film. And I told him, I said, I'm sorry, then I can't do your film. I says, I would tense up very, very much if I didn't get some kind of release. What do you mean release? And I said, you say no sex. I say yes. And he says, well, where in the world would you find anybody out in the middle of the desert? I said, that's for me to know and you to find out. He says, don't you tell the rest of the girls that you're going to be doing this. There, Slim, now you can get as vocal as you want. I was afraid she was going to karate chop me or something if I, you know, I don't think Toril ever liked me. I couldn't get any reaction from her. I couldn't get, um, I couldn't get her to give me what I needed to to bring the part out you know so I had to literally make her hate me and I did I scared the living crap out of that girl she's a sick girl you need rest honey a lot of rest but that was all the role so it was perfect I was in the world of being afraid and disturbed almost, <laughs> you know, if that was the world I lived in. The fact that this was really happening on the set was somewhat gave me more impetus to keep going. I never realized Lori got afraid of me because of the same thing. <laughs> I think maybe she was just in characters. People have said she's like a nice person, but I have never, she's never given that to me, but I'm sure she is. But I never knew if she really would do something for me and come to me in the middle of the night and chop my head off. I did mention when I went for the interview that I do know, uh, like Aikido and Karate, um, Kendo, Little Judo, and he said, well, could you incorporate that in some of the fight scenes? And I said, sure. Oh.